So I know you're thinking, why is he standing in between two barbecues? And it's not because I'm greedy. It's because I want to show you the difference between a coal burning barbecue and a gas barbecue. Essentially, they both do the exact same thing. You can grill on them. Um, there's a little bit of a difference. When you talk about grilling meats, essentially what you're talking about is cooking them directly on these grill bars here, on here, or on here, on your Weber. Now, that's grilling. Barbecuing, by American standards, means cooking low and slow, low temperatures for a long period of time. Okay, so if you're gonna wanna smoke meats or, or barbecue them slowly, then what you wanna do is you wanna create some smoke. Now you've got two options. On a gas barbie like this, which of course doesn't have um, any coals burning, what you need to do is get yourself a little tray like this that you can just get from coals and then drop your wood chips into there. I've pre-soaked the wood chips so they don't burn instantly, but what's gonna happen in just a moment is they'll start smoking. Now, on a coal barbecue, I've got to be perfectly honest with you, absolutely my preference. It does take a little bit longer to, to build the, the fire because you have to light the coals or the heat, beads, the heat beads in there. But what you can do, which is the best part of it, is grab your wood chips that you've just soaked in a little water. Okay. And you'll see the smoke will happen really quickly. Don't put too many. You don't want it to smoke you out. You can keep topping it up and adding more as the day goes on. You can see the smoke from the wood instantly starting as it hits the coal. So, so that's the beautiful thing about <coughs> cooking over the coal. And of course, decide how much smoke you keep in and how much you let out by your little uh, vents up here. So of course you need to keep them open a little so the fire doesn't go out. If you want to cook over a high heat, then you're going to put this directly over the coal. If you want to cook on a low heat, then you're going to put it in the middle so it's not over that direct heat. So, I'm going to do one steak over this side, delicious, and I'm going to do one over this side as well. Okay, so you take your steak directly over the coal and you're going to get that intense heat from there. I'm also going to cook this big piece of lamb, but I don't want that to be right over the heat. So I'm going to drop that down so the smoke can sort of infuse into the flavour of the steak. Got this whole piece of lamb here. I'm gonna sit that right in the middle there. Woohoo! So the obvious difference here is the charcoal barbecue is gonna give a whole lot more flavor. However, it's a little bit harder work. So if you're in a rush, cook on gas. If you've got the time, make sure you invest in this.